Hi travelers, hello from Barcelona. Today I want to show you how to get around in the city and what transport car you should buy. So the first thing you need to do is to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell if you want to get all the info before anybody else. My name is Valerie and as a local in Barcelona I share videos for you travelers about what to do in the city, how to plan your trip and a lot of super useful tips that you're gonna need for your trip in Barcelona. So the first thing that I want to talk about is the transport car T Casual. Ticaswalt appeared in 2020 to replace the famous T10. What has actually changed? What's the difference? Well, first let me tell you that if you want to buy a single ride in zone 1, either for the bus, for the train or the metro, the price is €2.40 at the moment I'm recording this video. So before, when we could buy the T10 car, it was great because it included 10 trips for just 1 euro and we could share it with more people, which was awesome. So this was actually the typical travel car that we locals could buy to move around in the city. But things have changed and now we have T Casual, which is actually the new car and it includes 10 trips for 11 euros 35, which is a little bit more expensive but the bad thing is that now it says unipersonal so it means we have to buy one car per person it is what it is travelers drawbacks from the tic as well yes there is a very important one it doesn't work to go or come from the airport to buy metro i'm sorry travelers so let's jump now into the transport car you should buy if you want to come or go from the airport to the city center there are actually four ways we have the taxi the aerobus the metro and the train taxi is the easiest way and faster we are talking about 40 euros then we have the aerobus which is 5 euros 90 cents cheaper than the taxi as you can see and faster than public transportation then we have the metro metro goes to both terminals one and two and pay attention here because you need an special ticket which is 5 euros 15 unless you have another transport car that i'm going to talk really soon and then we have the train the only problem with the train is that it goes to terminal two that's it if you need to go to terminal one you're going to have to take the free shuttle service from the airport the single trip, as I said before, is to Euro 40, but if you have the ticket as well, the trip will be covered. And also if you have any other transport card, the ride by train to the airport will be covered as well. So let's continue with the list of transport cards to buy. So now is the turn of the Te Dia. I don't know if you know these travelers, but I told you many times Barcelona is a city to walk. Of course, you're gonna need to use public transportation every now and then, but basically you can do almost everything by foot. So the Te Dia includes unlimited journeys in 24 hours in the zone you prefer. So I would say zone one, which is where all the main attractions are. And you can use the metro, the train, the bus and the tram all together so for only one day in Barcelona I don't really think you will use much public transportation nevertheless what's good about it you have a round trip to the airport covered plus the free rides so for the price 10 euros 50 it really makes sense think that the metro ticket to the airport is 5 euros 15 each trip so already 10 euros so it really makes sense Then we have the Barcelona travel cars per day. For example, we have two days, three days, four days, and five days, and they all include unlimited journeys and the round trip to the airport is covered, but you have to buy one car per person. Just a little disclaimer, if you bought already your ticket to Parkwell, which is awesome because this is what you should do, they are usually sold out. You'll see it includes a free bus ride towards the park. But from where? From Alphonse Deus. And do you know where it is? Well, it is not actually in the city center. So do not rely on this free bus ride because you're gonna need another means of transport to get there when we have the 24 bus and the V19 bus that go exactly towards the entrance of the park. Where to buy your transport card in Barcelona? Well, in these machines in the metro stations, either by cash or by credit card. And the PIN number if you use your card will be required, so make sure you remember it. Yeah. 
if you want to buy a ticket on the bus, they only sell single rides. And you can also buy the travel cars in any attractions. Okay, travelers, hope you now have a clear idea of what transport car to buy. Don't forget to download my Getting Around Guide by Neighborhood in the description down below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you next week, travelers, with a lot of new things about this city.